7 Promises That Jesus Did Not Make For You Nor For Christian False Prophets A teaching from Dr. Gavin Curra In the 21st century, certain Christian megachurches have begun claiming authority from Christ to heal diseases and to foretell coming events. You know who they are. However, their leaders have failed spectacularly to heal most diseases, and most of their prophecies have proven wrong. These presumptuous men and women have caused non-Christians to ridicule all churches, making Jesus seem a kind of joke. Their false claims have arisen from a fundamental mistake of Bible interpretation, for they have applied to themselves certain promises that Jesus made only to his apostles. Although most of the more than 200 promises that Jesus made do apply to all Christian believers, seven of them applied only to his apostles. Those seven special promises authenticated the apostles, their teaching, and their writings. These promises are as follows. 1. Power and authority over all spirits, and to heal all kinds of sickness and infirmity. Jesus called to him his twelve disciples and gave them authority over unclean spirits, to cast them out, and to heal every disease and every affliction. 2. To bind and to loose. Truly, I say to you apostles, whatever you bind on earth shall be bound in heaven, and whatever you loose on earth shall be loosed in heaven. 3. Effective prayers. Again I say to you, if two of you agree on earth about anything they ask, it will be done for them by my Father in heaven. 4. To do the same kinds of things that Jesus did. Truly, truly, I say to you, whoever believes in me will also do the works that I do, and greater works than these will he do, because I am going to the Father. 5. To pray in Jesus' name. Whatever you ask in my name, this I will do, that the Father may be glorified in the Son. If you ask me anything in my name, I will do it. 6. The Holy Spirit teach to them and to remind them of everything Jesus said. The Helper, the Holy Spirit, whom the Father will send in my name, he will teach you all things and bring to your remembrance all that I have said to you. 7. To reveal future events. When the Spirit of Truth comes, he will guide you into all the truth for he will declare to you the things that are to come. He will glorify me, for he will take what is mine and declare it to you. Certainly all Christian believers receive the Holy Spirit, they pray to God, they teach each other, and they announce the good news about Jesus. All Christian believers receive a gift from the Holy Spirit by which they effectively serve one another. However, Christians do not do so with authority to perform miracles at their will, nor do they reveal new truth from God.